time to make some buffalo cauliflower wings. Wings. I'm making a vegan version, so buckle up. Let's go. For food recipe, I will leave it linked in the description. But for this recipe, you will need a head of cauliflower, uh, some oat milk, all-purpose flour, garlic powder, onion powder, black pepper, paprika, cumin, salt, and then for the most important part, you need vegan butter. This one is Earth Balance. And the only wing sauce, Frank's Red Hot. All right, what do you got for me? Line baking sheets with parchment paper and preheat your oven to 450. We can do this. I'm gonna use the lower oven because I'm too short to see anything on this top one. Don't mind me. Please, dear God, have some parchment paper. That's not where the parchment paper is. That was completely obnoxious. Apologies. If you hear a sound in the background that sounds like someone's using a mixer, it's because that's the sound that my lovely oven makes. Wash and cut cauliflower. We can do that. Realizing now that putting down paper towels would have been wise. Do I even have to cut this? Can I just break this off with my hands? You 110% can. I should have gotten a bigger cutting board. Did not think this one through. And I already made one dirty. Do not want to make other one dirty. Okay, we need half a cup unsweetened non-dairy milk or whatever you want to use. I'm not here to judge or tell you how to live your life and eat. Just here to make some bomb ass buffalo bites. Then need half a cup of water. Three fourths of a cup all-purpose flour. Aha! Nailed it! Welcome to my chaotic kitchen. Now I got flour on my phone. Lovely. Two teaspoons. Garlic powder, onion powder. We can do that. And we need one teaspoon of cumin. It smells like Mexican food. That's what that cumin smells like. A teaspoon of pep. Wait, where's the smoked pep? Smoked pep is better than regular pep, if you ask me. Pep. Sit. Now we need a fourth of a teaspoon. This is a half teaspoon. Do we have a fourth? Uh, negative. So we need, so I'm gonna do half of this half teaspoon. Oh boy, that's about half. Fourth of a teaspoon of sea salt. Fourth of a teaspoon of Brown black pepper. We're just gonna eyeball this, but also, get My sister is screaming at this video right now. are in the oven, they're baking, bake them for 12 minutes, flip them, and then bake them for another 12, and then you put them in the sauce, and then you bake them for another amount of time that's predetermined on my instructions. Bake in the oven for another 25, wow, these bake for a long time. They gotta come out crispy. Bake for another 25 minutes. You can make, and this recipe that I'm gonna link also has a recipe for like a pseudo vegan ranch. I already have one. Um, the only thing is my mother does not have a dipping sauce because she is not vegan or even plant-based. But if you want to cool down your wings, you can cool them down with some honey or agave depending on your diet. One is plant-based, one is not. Or you can just use regular blue cheese and regular ranch if you're like a normal person but just wanted to try some cauliflower bites. Evie says, I want cauliflower bites. Too spicy for you. Too spicy. I know, there's a fly, sweetie. What do you think? I never drop you. Um, make sure you clean up your mess in between baking so the people you live with don't kill you for destroying the kitchen. It is at this point in time where you say, I've lost the patience for cooking. I just want to eat these. 
So I've got to coat these in the wing sauce and then they do another 25 in the oven. And then I can just go to town on some buffalo chicken bites, or not chicken, buffalo cauliflower bites. Yeah? Yeah, let's do that. just by picking these up they definitely could have done the air fryer but oh well oh that ranch is gross not bad not bad I don't know why oh no oh oh no I don't like that ranch but the wings are good. Don't try the ranch, it's nasty. Oh, are they super spicy? They're not actually. They're like perfectly spicy. I think they could have done the air fryer though. Like, unfortunately, it's just the nature of like cooking vegetables. They're watery. Yeah. And then you dip them. That's why I, I don't put breading on my herb. I, I know, but I, I like, that. I like I batter. And this one had like onion powder and like smoked paprika. Oh, I'm sure it's like, delicious. It just makes them so They're spicy, fully. Sorry. I don't care, I can just bleep you. They're really too spicy. They're too spicy? They're too spicy for me. It hurts already. Wait, what? <laughs> <coughs> oh no, I'm sorry. Yeah. You didn't even get any of the... Why don't you throw them in the air fryer? I know, I'm thinking about it. Because they're not, they're soggy. It's like they didn't... They're definitely cooked. But like, the cauliflower is cooked, but the they're soggy. Yeah. I mean, I'm not saying they're bad, but... Oh, you're not going to like that. It's gross. I know. Put them in the air fryer. Mm -hmm. Holy <laughs> They're way too spicy for me. Really? I don't think they're that spicy at all. You're not going like that either. I hate my life right now. <laughs> I'm so sorry. I'm going to go get a blizzard. My mom hates everything I cooked. Um, That's not true. Don't. Well. Um, I think when you throw it in, I would throw it in the um, air fryer. And it's going to make a big difference. Okay. I'm sorry you can't eat them. I might when they dry out a little. Maybe it won't. It'll be. Alright guys. If there's a whirring in the background, it's just the air fryer. So I put a batch in the air fryer. I think it's just the nature of the beast that they're gonna be a little soft because they're not chicken wings unless I actually put them in oil and fry them. They're definitely better, like it's less of a wet, like battery kind of thing. Not battery as in like a battery, but batter. Like much better. Much, much better. Mm -hmm. How's the flavor, still too hot? Still too hot for me. Mm. Uh -huh. Okay. I mean, I like it, but I definitely need to dip it in something. We can um, put some honey on them if we want to do that. That would probably be better, but no, I'm, I'm actually good. Well, now it's my goal to make like the perfect crispy buffalo cauliflower without frying it though, because I've made it. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> Is that how you feel whenever you're on a call and then little Olivia comes creeping down here like a gremlin, like, sorry, I'm just making coffee. So now it's my goal to make the perfect buffalo cauliflower without frying it. So yeah, um, thanks for watching. You can click the subscribe button if you wanna hang out. There's no height requirement to hang out here. And uh, yeah, follow me on all social media. Links are in the description, both Instagram and TikTok as well, where I like to tell stories about the weird things that have happened to me in my life. And yeah, I will see you guys next week. Bye.